In this video, we'll show how to use WebP images with WordPress in 2023. WebP is an image format that provides improved compression for images on the web. WebP images are around 30% smaller on average than their JPEG and PNG equivalents, resulting in sites that are faster and use less bandwidth. As you can see from the official WordPress newsfeed, native support for WebP images was added to WordPress from version 5.8 going forward, so you can directly insert such images into your posts and pages just as you would normally do with regular PNG or JPEG images. Here is a quick test, let's add a new post, I'll just name it test and I'll just drag and drop a WebP image in there. And you can see that it appeared just fine, we can preview the page and the image is still visible. But there are two major problems that come with the use of WebP. The first one is how to convert all of your existing images to WebP and the second one is to provide a fallback mechanism for browsers that don't support WebP. Basically, your site should still be able to serve the regular PNG and JPEG image formats for older browsers, otherwise visitors would not be able to see these images at all. As it usually happens in the world of WordPress, both of these problems can be solved with a plugin. So go to the WordPress dashboard, plugins, add new menu and make a search for WebP. As you can see, there are a number of different plugins out there that can get the job done. I'll go with the people's choice and the most downloaded plugin, which is eWWW Image Optimizer. You can see that it has over 1 million active installations, it has good reviews and it's compatible with the latest WordPress. Unlike for example WebP Express, which is still a perfectly good plugin, but it hasn't been updated recently, so I'm not sure if it's still being actively developed. Ok, let's install and activate eWWW Image Optimizer. Click on its settings menu. I'll skip this wizard and click on the I know what I'm doing link. Obviously you want to have the WebP conversion option enabled. With this option turned on, all of your new image uploads will be converted to WebP right away, while you should use the bulk optimizer for existing uploads. WebP delivery method, this part right here is super important, basically the plugin uses rewrite rules for Apache web servers in order to serve the WebP version of your images, so you need to press the insert rewrite rules button, otherwise this whole setup won't work. And the insertion was successful, and we can now see the green WebP image on the right side. Click on the bulk optimizer link to convert all the existing images in our library to WebP. Press the scan for unoptimized images button. Let's optimize those images. You have to allow some time for the process to complete. You can see a log file showing just how much smaller the WebP version of the image is compared to the regular PNG or JPEG. The bulk conversion is now complete, let's test our website to see if everything works correctly. What's really important to outline here is that the way these plugins work is that they don't change the URL to your images. So if we take a look at this image right here for example, let's open it in a new tab. You would see that it's still the old URL to the PNG file. What these plugins actually do is they create redirects to the WebP versions of your images without changing the URL, but by changing the MIME type of these images. So in order to really test if your site is serving WebP images after activating such a plugin, you would have to open the dev mode of your browser, so right click, inspect, switch to the network tab, make sure to disable the cache, then reload the page. And if we sort the requests by the file type, you should be able to see all those WebP requests. We do have several PNG requests, but they are for images hosted elsewhere and that's why we can't actually convert those. Nevertheless, a lot of other images were successfully converted, so we've made a significant performance improvement to our WordPress website. Thank you for watching this video.